today's video, I have a major update for AMC stock regarding the crazy announcement by Goldman Sachs. And guys, if you own AMC stock, you need to watch this video. Before I begin, if you like AMC stock, be sure to smash that like button. It only takes a few seconds and I really would appreciate it. Also, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you're new so you don't miss out on future videos. Keep in mind, this is not financial advice and this video is only for entertainment purposes. Be sure to do your own research and verify the information yourself as I am not a financial advisor. Now, guys. Guys, I do want to quickly mention for a very limited time, our channel sponsor Moomoo is now giving away 7 free stocks that could be valued up to $2,500 each just for opening a brokerage account and making a deposit of $100 or more. Guys, this is basically free money. Do not miss out on this opportunity to get up to 7 free stocks. What are you waiting for? Check out the link in the description as this promotion is only available for a limited time. Now let's get right into it. So as we know, the stock market is closed today at least in the u.s due to a holiday but that does not stop the news from flowing through so i actually wanted to share a shocking message for amc holders from a huge institution called goldman sachs so let me read the message and then tell you my thoughts and prediction for this week so according to a recently published article by goldman sachs analyst they revealed in a research note that retail investors have sold most of their u.s stock purchases from the last two years and and over the last seven weeks alone, $26 billion has flowed out of U.S. equity ETFs and mutual funds, which are often traded by retail investors. Furthermore, guys, Goldman Sachs says the rise of retail investors and the meme stock movement was largely a result of a narrative they called TINA, which stands for there is no alternative. The idea is that because interest rates were so low, savings accounts, government bonds, and other interest rate sensitive investing alternatives just didn't pay enough to be worthy of investment by the retail crowd as a result there was record investment into risk assets like tech stocks meme stocks and cryptocurrencies as investors hunted for stronger returns since 2020 fiscal stimulus near zero interest rates and record high equity allocations supported tina but investors are now facing rising interest rates and recession concerns the analyst wrote adding that there has been a sharp reversal of the tina trend over the past few months it's now the age of tara which stands for there are reasonable alternatives goldman sachs says that that's reversing households aggressive stock purchases which have significantly contributed to the recent stock market sell-off it appears that despite amc's recent rebound due to the success of top gun maverick the speculative investing of meme stock era is mostly over so guys this is absolutely crazy goldman sachs just said that the meme stock era is over and if you guys read the full article i believe they are talking about both a AMC and GameStop stock. Now, I do give them credit because it is true retail investors are not investing into stocks like they used to a few years ago, but that does not mean most of retail has sold off their shares of stocks such as AMC. I have not found any data that shows retail no longer owns majority of the float. This is why even with what Goldman Sachs posted, I do believe they are missing a key piece to the puzzle, and that is who actually controls most of the float as well as the short interest percentage of of these companies which doesn't seem to be decreasing at all now as far as this upcoming week is concerned i do predict we could see the momentum from last week continue into this week when a key level to watch out for guys is going to be 13 dollars per share it will be interesting to see if amc can break that level of resistance otherwise be prepared for a further retracement now guys do me a favor and drop a comment let me know do you agree or disagree with goldman sachs claim that the meme stock era is mostly over with that said if you enjoyed this quick update be sure to smash that like button i really would appreciate it and also be sure to subscribe if you're new so you don't miss out on future updates keep in mind this is not financial advice and this video is only for entertainment purposes you should never make any decisions to buy hold or sell stocks based on this video